What's up, world? It's your boy Iconic. Back again with another video. Yes, sir. We are back in the Iconic Studios. Back with another review. Back with another banger, man. We have a quick review, a shoe that released today. And I seen it already. It's okay, but we're gonna do a review and go over one more time just to kind of give you my honest opinion. Let's not waste any time, man. Let's get into it. Before we start this video, though, y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and also that notification bell so you can stay in tune with the reviews, the own feats, the sneaker vlog, and the sneaker news, and everything else that's coming with the channel. Definitely hit that like button, man, so we can stay in that algorithm and so more people can view the videos. Let's get into it. Boom, we have a box directly, directly, directly from DTLR. We not gonna hold this up today. Shout out to DT, oh! We ain't gonna hold up the video too much today. Again, packaged directly from DTLR. Receipt boys in the building. You already know what's going on. No, no faking, no flogging, none of that extraness, man. Boom, right here we have a Nike box. I'm not doing the whole spill because I want to just knock this video out. You see what's going on, regular OG box. Box label reads, Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG. Colorway, LT Fusion, Red, Black, White, Rogue, Fuchsia. Fuchsia? Fusion. Um, Clear, Blanc, and Noir. Retail on the joints was 170. Um, size eight and a half. Anybody that need to check the, the label, this is what's going on here on the label. Boom, boom. Flip the lid. Um, you already know it. Lot number right in there. Hopefully y'all can see that lot number. It's right in there. Lot number, boom. Put that to the side. Let's flip these back so I can see it. Mm. Okay. All right. I'm seeing them again. Standard paper. Nothing extra comes with the, uh, the paper. No special box, none of that type of stuff. Put that to the side. Boom, and we have it here. What do they call these joints? <laughs> I've heard everything. The Ronald McDonald's, um, all different types of names. I guess the Fuchsia, Fuchsia ones maybe? I don't know, y'all tell me in the comments what they call these joints. But we do have it here, man. A little, little shoe, man. A lot of crazy hype at first, but they not looking like they are doing too much online. Um, as far as uh, sell them out though, they sold out locally, but here it is. Quick review of this joint. You got the bottom, which is all black, all black bottom. White midsole, white midsole, white stitching all the way throughout the midsole. Um, upper, upper is leather. Quality, quality butter though. Quality, no lie, right? I don't like this colorway, but quality is nice. Quality is nice, quality is nice, quality is nice. As you can see, um, you do have your hits maybe that fuchsia or red it's, it's a very to me i would say it's like a peak in my opinion i don't know where people talk about red it's no red on here maybe this is a a, a certain um what certain red that's on the palette but it looks pink to me in my opinion have the yellow swoosh white toe box white side panels on the lateral and medial side ankle area does have that hit of gold which i think is very nice on the shoe um jump man is in all black boom guts all black nothing crazy on that um tongue white nylon tongue right there you do have that nike air uh and like a gradient hopefully y'all can see that it's like a gradient right there gradient on that right there boom gradient boom like that I like that white shoe strings it does come man they went crazy for this shoe for it not to be like an og colorway something they just trying they went crazy on it um you got some fuchsia Shoe strings, black shoe strings, yellow shoe strings, <clears throat> yellow shoe strings, and then white shoe strings right here that come with the shoe that's already, <clears throat> damn, that's already in the shoe. You got the white laces already in the shoe. And like I say, man, personally, I think it's, I don't think this shoe is all that. I personally would tell you to save your bread. If, you, if, if, if I'm you, I'm saving my bread. Here is the shoe tree. Boom. Again, white laces. Hopefully y'all can see inside here, but this is the actual insole. Boom, 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 it's size eight and a half. Uh, size and tag right there. Uh, dates on this joints is 11-11-20 uh, to February 5th, 2021. Don't know if y'all gonna be able to see that for anybody that's trying to do any legit check purposes. 
Hopefully y'all can see it, probably won't. But that's what's going on right here in the tag. Boom, that's how it looks. Can I pull this up? I don't wanna rip it. I'm gonna rip it. It's glued down, definitely glued down. Yeah, I ain't finna rip it. I don't wanna feel like I might rip it, so I'm gonna leave that alone. But I wanna hear from y'all, man. What y'all think about the shoe? Personally, personally, in my opinion, it is an easy, and I mean easy, easy, easy pass, bro. Easy pass for me. OG Johnny said he had to have them. He already put like the yellow laces in them and everything. But me personally, um, I think it's a pass. It's not needed. I got plenty of Air Jordan 1s. Um, speaking of that, y'all go watch my Air Jordan 1 KO video, on feet video, and watch the actual video, the, uh, the actual um, review of this joint, man. Very hot shoe, very slept on shoe. A shoe that is going uh, about 180 to 220. I, uh, uh, it's going for 180 to 220. Um, and personally, I would say buy this now before it shoots up. This is an OG sneaker um, that I could see grow, growing in the future. Um, but anyway, yeah, man, I definitely think this shoe is okay. I don't think it's all that. It's okay. Um, if you need to buy it, time is now. You never know what's going to happen with the market. People are getting like 240, 250, 275. It's depending on the size itself. Um, some people even charging over three. Which, you know, I ain't speaking on that. They can do their thing. Um, I was getting rid of my size eight and a half for like 275 and my size 13 for 275 because that's kind of like the going rate locally. I don't know how it is at like none of the resale shops, but just make me some quick little coins, man. Nothing too crazy. Nothing too crazy or put it on a raffle. But yeah, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about the shoe. Is it hot? Is it not? Is it something that you would like to have in your collection? Did you buy today? Did you strike out on sneakers app? Went for them on the sneakers app, took the L. Went to DTLR, it was first come first serve, and got uh, got this pair right here. So, y'all let me know in the comments, man, what y'all think about the shoe, let me know what you think about the video, let me know what you think about the review, man. Before I go, y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and also that notification bell so you can stay in tune with the reviews, the on feats, the sneaker vlogging, the sneaker news, and everything else that comes with the channel. Thank y'all for watching. Future belongs to those who prepare today. Till tomorrow, y'all. Peace.